guys! Welcome to my vlog. I'm Pia Margaret Mohatangay from Young's 12 Matulungin. And I'm going to discuss about leadership development and participatory planning. Leadership development and participatory planning are two interconnected concepts that play a crucial role in organizational success and community engagement. Both are essential for fostering collaboration empowering individuals and driving sustainable change, leadership development refers to the process of enhancing the abilities, skills, and knowledge individuals to lead effectively within an organization or community. And leadership development is a critical aspect of any organization growth and success. It involves identifying, nurturing, and refi refining the skills and abilities of individuals to become effective leaders a well-rounded leadership development program should focus on various aspects including communication, decision-making, problem-solving, and team-building. In this essay, we will explore the importance of leadership development, the various methods used for developing leaders, and the role of authority preference in this field. Enhancing organizational performance by developing leaders, organizations can improve their overall performance as effective leaders can drive strategic planning, execution, and continuous improvement. Improving employee engagement and satisfaction when employees feel supported and led by strong leaders, they are more likely to engage and satisfy with their work. Leadership development is crucial for organizations to achieve their goals by maintaining our competitive edge by employing various methods and approaches such as formal training, mentoring, coaching, and action learning. Organizations can cultivate effective leaders who can drive success. In participatory planning processes, stakeholders are actively involved in identifying issues, setting priorities, generating solutions, and implementing action plans. These approaches foster a scene of ownership and commitment among participants leading to more sustainable outcomes that align with the needs and aspirations of the community or organization. Integration of leadership development and participatory planning, integrating leadership development with, with participatory planning creates a synergistic effect that enhances both processes when leader processes strong facilitation skills and understanding of participatory approaches they can effectively engage stakeholders in collaborative decision making process in summary leadership development and participatory planning are integral components for fostering effective leadership and sustainable community or organizational development their integration creates a powerful framework for inclusive decision making collaborative problem solving and adaptive leadership participatory planning is a democratic approach to urban and regional planning that involves local communities stakeholders and residents in the decision making process this approach aims to create more inclusive sustainable and responsive plans that address the needs and aspiration of all community members. Participatory planning has been gaining traction in recent years due its potential to foster social cohesion, enhance local ownership, and ensure that plants are more respect representative of the diverse needs and interests of the community. Stakeholders' engagement is another essential component of participatory planning Stakeholders can include government agencies, non-governmental organizations, businesses, and community-based organizations. By involving these various groups in the planning process, planners can ensure that a wide range of perspectives are considered and that the final plan takes into account the needs and interests of all parties involved. This can help to build conscious support for the plan it's more likely to be successfully implemented. And again, participatory planning is an essential approach to urban and regional planning that involves local communities, stakeholders, and residents in the decision-making process by fostering transparency, accountability, and inclusivity. Participatory planning can lead to more sustainable, equitable, and responsive plans that address the diverse needs and interests of the community. And that's all that I can tell about
about leadership development and participatory planning. Thank you for watching my vlog. <laughs> Go. Hi guys. <laughs> Both are essential for fostering collaboration, empowering individuals, and driving sustainable change. Leadership development. Uh, both are essential for okay. In participatory plan. And that's all that I can tell about in Stakeholders, stakeholders. Leadership development is a crucial 